Hello there, I'm Toby and I'm over here. No wait, I'm over here. Or back here. Do you have any idea what I'm talking about? Smashing. Let's get starting on the video about teleportation in QCraft. QCraft is a mod in Minecraft which adds some elements of quantum mechanics. This is the second video that I've made, this one deals with a slightly more advanced subject of quantum computers and teleportation. I'll be referencing things that I explained in the previous video, so if you haven't seen that, I highly suggest you go watch it and come back. Still with me? Good. QCraft adds a block called the quantum computer, made with iron ingots, a glass pane and some quantum dust. This in turn can be made into a pair of entangled quantum computers by adding the essence of entanglement. For the sake of speed and my lack of tongue twisting abilities, we'll call them QCs and EQCs in this video. Okay, we've got them done. The next thing you'll need is some observer dependent blocks. If you remember, these are the QCraft blocks which resolve into certain blocks depending on which direction you observe them from. You're going to need gold blocks and obsidian to make this ODB. Fill all the slots with obsidian bar one, which is for the gold. Make that ODB. You then need to swap one of the compass slots, gold for obsidian, like so. You need to do this with every compass point twice, meaning you'll end up with 8 ODBs, 4 sets of 2, whose gold face is a different direction. These are important, and we'll call them our anchor ODBs. Next, you're going to want to mark out the 4 points of the area of your intended teleportation. So for instance, here I've marked out the area with wool. Now, place your anchor ODBs so that the inside face is the gold block. In other words, when you look at your anchor ODB from the inside area, it resolves to gold. Do this with each direction. At the point where the anchor ODBs meet in the middle, place your quantum computer. Let's pause a second and explain a few things. The QC block is solitary, meaning it's not connected to another QC. The entangled quantum computer, the EQC block, is connected, or entangled, with another computer. This means that if you want to simply store, or quantize, whatever you're teleporting, you use the solitary QC block. If you want to actually teleport, place down an EQC. This is all complicated, I know, but I'm trying. Bear with me. Place a block of ice adjacent to your EQC, and then build pillars above your anchor ODBs as high as you want your build to go. Finally, top off your teleporter pillars with glass. Okay, done all that? Right, build another one. Let's do that. Okay, done. Using the magic of fast forward. Remember to put down the EQC that is entangled with your first EQC. Now let's test it out. I'm just placing a few blocks down, then hitting my EQC and pressing Energize. The blocks will be teleported to your receiving teleporter in exactly the same configuration. Of course, if this was just a QC, they wouldn't be teleported, just stored in the QC so you could place it back down and have them placed alongside it. Lastly, if there's something in both teleporters, the two things will be swapped, so be aware of that. This teleportation system has many, many uses in Minecraft, from moving houses to transporting water. If you follow these steps and it doesn't work for you, then see if you're doing any of these things wrong. Thanks for watching this complicated video about a complicated mod. I strongly recommend you go and try it out yourself. Soon you'll be teleporting vast swathes of the desert into the nether. If you liked, subscribe, and then go and give your brain a rest.